and a look at the dazzling arches of the Bay Bridge and beyond it, San Francisco. 2K Sports brings you the NBA on a Friday afternoon. Happy to be with you with Clark Kellogg and Steve Kerr. This is Kevin Harlan. The starting fives for our game. Here are tonight's starting lineups. First for the Nuggets. And for Golden State, Steph Curry is out there with Clay Thompson. And in the middle, the long body JaVel McGee. Absolutely elastic. And it's Durant, and it's Green, and at the power forward position. You know, you might have expected a team that finished third in the West to have a positive road record, but the Nuggets last season actually finished south of 500 when they left the Pepsi Center. So Golden State will get the first possession. Curry with it. Curry gets the screen from McGee. Durant dishes to Curry. Golden State moving the ball around. Thompson passes to Curry. Four on the shot clock. Here's Durant. It's hauled in by the Nuggets. Well, Clark, as you said, with the Nuggets on the road, 19 and 23 record for them on the road. Was the difference between them and, and the Thunder, Steve, in that division? Well, they were so dominant at home, Kevin, and they always have been, just with their style of play and the altitude. Uh, but it's just tough to go out and play that same style on the road when you're running constantly. You're just more vulnerable uh, defensively when you play that style when you're out on the road uh, than you do when you play it at home. And just about a minute into the first quarter. All alone. And that one's good. Well, and the bounce pass was the key to the play. So it's the Warriors now. Now the feed to Curry. Green with a screen for Curry. Back to Green. Good, and Curry gets the assist. Green's got his second bucket. The second he got around the pick and shook his man, it was straight to the bucket for the easy dupe. Very, very well done. Number 15, zero. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Chance here now for a three-point play. He got a great read of where that miss was going, and that allowed him to be the first guy to it and get the putback. Denver making a switch here. And one of the things you know you're going to see from this guy is his skill running the pick and roll. He knows exactly how to run a defender directly into that screen and then the beautiful passing ability, setting up layups and jump shots. And the other most noticeable thing about him to me is his passing. I mean, he makes things so easy for his teammates. All they have to do is get to the right spot on the floor and he'll get it to them. We've got 28 seconds left here in the first quarter. Number 41. Number 23. It's good on the putback. Tell you what, they're going to have to do a better job of boxing this fellow out than that. No one between him and the hoop. You're right, Clark. Yeah, putback slams are not what you want to be giving up if you're the defense. And it goes as the official calls the foul. Count it. We'll shoot one more at the free throw line. See how he used the rim to protect the ball perfectly from the defender on that reverse. The Warriors shooting their first free throw of the game. The free throw off from McGee. Here's Murray. Nelson outside. And here's Gallinari outside. Number 23. At the end of one, a closely contested game so far. Warriors lead by one. And back with the start of the second quarter in just a moment. And we got a close game here as we get back to the second quarter. And a chance to catch up on some numbers here. The scoring breakdown for the Warriors. 
And right from the start, guys, it's apparent they're determined to establish a presence in the paint. Also, what passing we've seen from them here early. I mean, there could be a big number in the assist column if this keeps up. Yeah, the Warriors turn around, I think, in large part because of the improvement defensively and on the boards last year. There was a five or six year stretch where Golden State was maybe the worst team in both categories in the entire league, but the schemes have changed, the personnel, uh, the intent, the toughness, and it has all led to a new era for the Golden State Warriors basketball team. Duran hits them both. And back to the Warriors looking to pack the paint. If you wanted to get into a three-point shooting contest with them, well, I think they'd I think they'd welcome that. I agree. <laughs> I mean, with the Splash Brothers in the backcourt, you can get sprayed in a hurry from all angles. I mean, those guys are terrific. But again, their improved defense and rebounding was a big part of their success as well. It's tipped. Stolen by McGee. Outside Durant. Puts the lead pass in front of him. Curry kicks to McGee. Can't hit. The Nuggets trail by three. He dishes it to Nelson. And the layup's good off the glass. Well, every once in a while, he'll show us some pretty good moves around the hoop. 107 left in the first half of basketball. Curry against Nelson. Curry dishes to Durant. Back to Curry. Feeds it to Durant. Passes it to McGee. Six to shoot. And he finishes nicely on the layup. And Denver has possession. They trail by three. Here's Murray up on top. He's covered by Thompson. Number 23. Some hang time on that rim. Puts a little whipped cream on that angel food cake there. <laughs> it's a tight ball game. <laughs> and those displays of strength, Clark, can get one team rolling. Agree. Oh, boy. Whipped cream, cherry on top. It's, it always comes back to dessert for Clark. <laughs> Yeah, he had not established position. You know, I prefer the refs to whistle with a block when in doubt. I thought that was a good call there. The Warriors shooting their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight. They have a very average shooting team in terms of the free throw line. About 76% a year ago. And the Nuggets making a change here. You know, they've changed their game here in the second. Getting a little bit more physical. Playing with some toughness now. And you know, this lead is going to grow if they can continue to get to the free throw line. Here's Murray. He's covered by Thompson. Number 15. And it's Denver scoring again. Second quarter ends in a tight one. The Warriors on top, up by one. It's the NBA on 2K Sports from Oracle Arena in Oakland, California. Now, presented by Sprint. Welcome, fans. We got a close game going on out in Oakland. The Golden State Warriors are ahead against Denver. One look at their field goal percentage says it all. They're scoring at will. JaVel McGee has been the X factor. They aren't exactly eye-catching numbers, but don't be fooled. He's came to play, and he's leading them towards victory in this one. Meanwhile, the Nuggets not to be outdone and give them credit defensively. They're boxing out, controlling their defensive backboards. Thanks so much for stopping on by. Third quarter just around the corner, so let's get on back out to Kevin and the crew. The Sprint Halftime Report, presented by Sprint. And it's been a back-and-forth game so far with no ground given through the first half. Third quarter starting here now. It's thrown by Curry. The finish. The fast break ends at the rim with the jam. 
And he's the type of player who, you know, when he gets it going, is almost impossible to cool down. Coaches will call a timeout sometimes just to take away some of the momentum uh, that he provides for that club. And something else he does is he's great off the dribble. He can take it to the rack or pull up. So as a defender, you don't know how to play him. Free throw good by Curry. You know, you look at the characteristics of good teams, and a lot of things jump out at you. But one that's really important is being a good free throw shooting team. That hasn't always been a strength of the Warriors, but over the last few years, they've made big strides at getting better in that area. Farid a screen on Curry. Down to five on the shot clock. Zero. And Thompson sends it back. Thompson left side. Kicks to Curry. Curry gets the screen from McGee. Inside. Oh! Tell you what, he's going to put that one in his scrapbook. Absolutely insane with that dunk. Well, now they're starting to rub it in. Aren't they have a build up a lead? And here we go, folks. It's showtime. And why not? I mean, the more plays they make like that, the more they'll have these guys on the ropes. There's a screen. Zero. Pass to Barton. off the rim. And for the Warriors, Clark and Berto did as they shot just under 79% from the free throw line last year. That was good for fourth in the NBA. Steve, not bad considering their centers are not known for their good free throw shooting to begin with. No, but their guards are just ridiculously effective shooting the ball. In fact, anytime there was a technical foul last year, it was like there was a fight to get to the line. They had so many people to choose from, but that's a big part of the success of this club. Just the incredible shooting, both from the perimeter and from the foul line. Everything's falling now, and this lead continues to increase. Yeah, it's just way too hard to keep up with a scoring pace like this. I mean, and that's why the defense is having a tough time. Timeout is called first of the game for the Nuggets. He just is not happy with how his team is executing. And they've been on the wrong side of this run. It's time for a momentum shift. You know, sometimes just getting off the court, taking a break, and coming back out fresh will give you a chance to pull together. Murray, the pass to Barton. Pass to Murray. And there's the call on Durant. That is his first foul of the game. Here's Martin. And no good trying to get that one. Well, through three quarters of play, down double digits, it may be difficult to overcome. Warriors lead by 10. And time to step aside quickly, but we'll be back in no time with the start of the fourth quarter. And the final period of play just about to start. In a moment here to take a look at some hustle stats for the Warriors. Their activity at the defensive end, Kevin, has been really impressive. Attacking and coming away with steals. They've been firing on all cylinders in the transition game, too. I mean, they've really run the break well. Now here is McGee. That one goes. Count. McGee's got the first points up on the board here in the fourth for the Warriors. Now Murray dishes it to Barton. Number 15, guarded by McGee. And there's the pass to Murray. Shoots a fader. No luck. And Golden State will come the other way. Stolen by Fareed. Number 15. They get it back. A second chance effort. Here's Murray. And finally they hit one. You know, that putback's about as easy as it's going to get. You, you have to put a body on someone down there. Well, no box out. That's the result you get right there. Now here's Durant. Outside Curry. He kicks it to Green. Back to Curry. Some nice passing by Golden State. Five on the clock. 
Green dishes to Curry. And the three off target. Nuggets have gone one of four since the end of the third quarter. Murray, good. The defense left him just a little window to get through, and he just ducked in for the layup. Terrific job. Green picks to Durant. Outside for Curry. He feeds it to Thompson. It's intercepted. Got no way you can come back from this deficit. Just not enough time left on the clock. A follow-up flush. They got on this roll a while ago, and they just haven't looked back. He could have tipped it home, but he wanted to give this crowd something to remember. Dynamic work right there. Throw down that rebound. Yes, sir. You know, no need to back it out if you're in position for the dunk. And no good as the first free throw missing for him. We'll see if he can nail the second. Denver making a switch here. And he does get the second one. And that makes it a seven-point lead. Just about one and a half minutes gone by here on the fourth. Here's Burton. Off target from outside. Warriors shooting the lights out in this one. 77%. Durant kicks to Kirk. The dish to McGee. as he doesn't get the first one to fall. Trying to focus now on the second. And he can't get the second one to drop either. Coming up empty that time. Here's Murray. It's good from beyond the arc. So it's a hero victory for the Warriors pulling out the W. It was tight, but they managed to come up with the win. You know, nobody wants to lose a close game, Kevin. It's much better to win those tight ones. And that'll do it for Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and Doris Burke. This is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching this presentation of the NBA on 2K Sports. And now we present the Jordan player of the game, Stephen Curry.